When there's a game that has been updated over and over again, you always want to come back to it to see what's been updated, what's been added, what's been discontinued, and what can make, well, you enjoy it more. And one of those games is Jojo Poses Simulator, a game that I have played multiple, multiple times on this channel, and it's come back again, this time in, with new poses in 2024. Now, to film the entire, like, the entire video, it actually took over a couple days. Now, my plan was to just kind of do, like, videos whenever Posey came out, because he, he, decided, he kind of came back to it now, which is great, he's come back to it, and he's actually going to try and gradually update it a bit more, hopefully. But, he has, he has he's trying to update it now, which is great. And there was new new poses over the span of like I think it was like I like to say a week, but I feel like it wasn't a week. It was like more than a week because there's one pose that that had like three parts to it, and it was uploaded one part each, and that took over a couple of days because it was like really really hard to animate, really really long. So you can see a lot of avatar changes as well from they from some at once to another. There is some like change in the avatar because you know obviously. I haven't finalised my avatar then, which you will see um, this season, yes, that I have got an avatar on Roblox that is for each season, so don't worry. You're going to see a lot of change in that as well, which means a lot of Roblox is going to be buying, which is just great, that's incredible. Even actually right now, I brought something a couple of days ago, and that is actually the final piece of thing I want to add, at least for the avatar I have right now. Which you haven't seen yet, which is great. Thumbs up all around. Why do I like this, this video game so much? Why do I like poses? Like, that doesn't, that's, not, that's not the sort of thing to kind of rack up views, you think? You think that's something that would really, um, kind of be a bit boring. But honestly, I like, I like, <clears throat> I like Jojo Bizarre Adventure. It's a great anime, um, which is quite surprising. Uh, because most animes I, I don't really enjoy. For some reason this one actually took a special place in my heart. And I thought that, you know what? Why not just like, play a game based on it? In fact, it was actually the first thing I ever played that got me into JoJo Poses. Which, now looking back at it, I never really knew what was what. So, back then, I didn't know what JoJo was. I never ever heard of it. And so I played that, and I started watching Jojo memes, Jojo clips. I was like, yeah, it's pretty an anime. I wonder why I can watch it. Sco a, a friend at school saw me watching those uh, anime stuff, and I was like, you watch jo Do you watch Jojo Bizarre Adventure? No, I don't. And you watch the clips of that. So you haven't watched it yet. How do I watch it? And bang, I've watched the entirety of 1 to 5. I actually started to watch, have to watch 6. It's on Netflix, so I've just. I don't care. Basically, that was my introduction to Joseph's Bizarre Adventure, and also the reason why I actually fell in love with the game because I just realised, wait a minute, this is actually a game that, firstly, is an anime I enjoy, and secondly, it's something that I enjoy. It's really like I feel like I'm showcasing something I haven't even made. Like I'm showcasing my friends' like cool work and how you should also try it out. Show them some love so they can keep updating the game and keep making it better. That's kind of how I see it. I want to show people um, kind of Forex's work and show you of how great an animator he is. I mean, he has a YouTube channel, but I want to go into that because I've already gone into that like five episodes ago on my second channel. Was it third? Not even fourth. I think it was fourth. That's pretty cool, though. He's pretty cool. Like, I barely talked to him, but yeah, he's pretty cool. I like him. But yeah. I hope it ties to you in some way to watch the DFF video first and then go and play the game for yourself. I think you're really enjoying it, especially if you're a JoJo fan. Because I mean the only other good JoJo games there are is um
Uh, none. Yeah, none off the top of my head. Yep, that's how, that's how bad Holmes is.